Hey, I want to see what you guys think of this real quick. So it was reported that the CEO of General Electric, GE, um, you know, they have private planes, of course. The, the big company, I think they have seven private planes to be exact. But it was reported that the CEO, when he would travel out of the country, and this happened this year, that he would actually take two planes with him. He would fly in one, and then he would have an empty plane fly with him overseas or wherever he went, just so he could leave if he had to, and the plane broke down, or uh, for security reasons is another reason they gave. And so I want to know what you think about that. Should a CEO have two private planes to travel around the country when he's meeting with clients? Now, my opinion personally is if that is driving growth, adding shareholder value, and they're paying it back in the form of like earnings or the stock price is appreciating, then give them five planes. I don't care. But if you're going to spend $20 million a year to travel with two planes, security details and all this stuff, and you're not adding any value, then I think you can rent a car, right? Take a cruise ship over there and then rent a car. Or sit first class for all I care, but no private plane. Now, GE stock is down 35% this year alone, and if you go back over the last five years, not that much better. So whatever the guy is doing, flying overseas, taking two planes with him, nobody seems to care. He's not adding any more business to the books, and the share price surely isn't benefiting. But what do you think? Should a CEO have not only one plane, but two planes, an empty plane following? If you get a chance, take a look at how Walmart executives travel much, much difference. And uh, if you take a look at the stock price, also much different as well. Let me know what you think.